Welcome back to Attack of the B Team, everybody. I am here by myself, doing some things here. And, uh, as you see, oh god. This is an abomination if I've ever seen one. But we're gonna ignore him for now. So, I've been doing a lot off camera. I haven't been recording much of the B Team because I had a good bunch of it recorded. Uh, me and Ryan will hop back into Witchery soon, as soon as Ryan is available. But, uh, you know, school starts back up. School started back up for everyone else, not just me. Uh, look at this King Slime Battle Sign. So, I have this. I have this uh, little pond of uh, slime water, and there's a trivet in there, and he kills them every now and then. Unless, goddamn, I fell in. Unless it is the King Slime. The King Slime will just fucking suffocate in here. So, if you think about it, it's pretty much a King Slime farm. Not really. I know there's a way we can actually make a really good farm, but, uh. Not a really good farm. We can capture them and then make a farm out of that, which is pretty cool. And then I guess there's a bunch of yellow hearts. I actually got a yellow heart from uh, the one that died here. We got five of them. Saving some from Ryan. For Ryan. Why not fucking catch one? Okay, so. We are gonna be showing off some things today. I've been working on a village. A communal village, because uh, the recent update of Attack of the B Team was a problem with villages spawning and biomes are plenty, so no villages are like found on the map, but I've been working on a community village and I'll show you guys that. But first, we need to spice up that village with a couple of villages of my own, so I've been working with Necromancy here. Sorry, you know the rockets and the ammo clips, but I've been working Necromancy, we got the song machine here, and uh, I got some uh, dudes that I want to create here. As you see, just, just give them the legs, dang. Now that's beauty if I've ever seen it. I would mate with this villager. But uh, I believe if we shift right click, we will birth one of our, our beautiful beings here. Yeah, can I, no, you cannot. No, you need this right now. You got it. Okay. But uh, how do I? Release mode. No, we want capture mode. Boop. So we'll capture that guy right there. So yeah, we got our villages here. Why does he have 39 health now? What the fuck? Don't they spawn with like... I don't... Oh, is it 39 health now? But, uh, let, let me make... Quickly, let me make another Ender Pearl thing here. I need to farm more Ender Uh... Let me just... Let me, let me just do this. <clears throat> so, let me talk about this trophy here. Uh, I really... Me and Dakota fought a bunch of Withers, and I think I fought them in the last episode. And uh, I was able to make this or curses if we curse anyone and we want them to be uncursed it's the statue of the goddess all you do is right click if you have a curse i'll make a little jingle noise like ding 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 or some shit like that and uh <clears throat> boom right there you will be uncursed all right welcome to the earth man welcome man you fucking run for me my villager okay does he have all he also has things yeah, that's odd uh, but, is this like glitched out? Oh no. Oh, it disappeared. Let's see if I can like glitch it and make another one. But, uh, we have these guys in here. You guys are never gonna see. I mean, maybe you guys might help me with something. But yeah, let's head over to the village. I'm gonna go into an owl here. Uh, we're actually gonna take a advanced portal there. So we're just gonna go teleport to Jack's house. Just because. We don't have a teleporter in our area, but we will probably get one soon. So advanced portals. I had to spend like an hour figuring out these without like using a wiki or anything. But uh, you know, we are good now and we will just head on through. And well, here we are. Go back to Go back to Go back Here we are in the village. I don't have any food on me. I have apples. Oh no, we have no ones. Now let's start with this thing. This thing I worked very hard on. And it looks really cool because I saw a picture on the uh, advanced portals wiki. No, it's enhanced portals wiki. And it looked really cool to me. Not the wiki, the uh, mod page. And it looked really cool and I wanted to make something like it. We'll wait for this uh, fucking thing to disappear. There you go. Alright. So this, let's start off with this. There it goes. Oh! Man, that's sexy. You see that? That's really cool. And then plus you can like dye the portal and stuff and make his mouth red when the portal lights up. You can dye the portal like whatever color you want. Really cool, it's a snake. I couldn't tell. But uh, yeah, so this village is still a work in progress. We got a little bit of work to be done here, me and Dakota. 
and maybe I'll try and get everyone else to contribute a house, but so far we have a little amount of houses, all different types, you got these little uh, micro block things here with the witchery glow glow button, which is just, you just do it like this, down three times to the right, Lumos, and that will shoot the little glow globe, and uh, we got the houses here, villages don't know how to open these doors, fucking Dr. Seuss, we got these guys, as you see here, and so far since we, the next version of Attack of the B Team actually includes how, how to make the caramel and stuff like that to get the candy armor, I've been training these guys to get the candy armor, because they just look so amazing, and I gotta, I gotta, put, I gotta put them to use. Whenever we fight the Ender Dragon, I'll probably use that candy armor. But, uh, see here we got a bunch of villages, all kinds, just trying to get all the pieces for the arm set. I think I'm only missing boots. Uh, we got Elvis, you know, Elvis is always important to have. Candy Axe. But a uh, very nice and peaceful area. Can you move? He's standing right by the door. Oh, let me just pick him up. There go. Okay. Thanks for getting out of the fucking way. <clears throat> Do we have a bed? I don't think we have a bed. Can we make a bed? No, we cannot. So, the next cool thing here. I actually got the, like, sort of model from Generic B because I had troubles in the first season making a villager face. So I just try to uh, copy with different blocks and uh, see how good this looks. But boom! The villager sacrificial emerald machine here. A very nice farm we got going. <clears throat> very cool. I like, uh, I like generic, B, generic B design for villager face. And it looks very sexy. We got a bunch of cobblestone. I believe this is all cobblestone. And uh, we got a bunch of emeralds in here. We got solid air blocks. I think Morphington Owl really quick. Really quick. Really quick. Wait a minute, what the fuck? Yeah, there's supposed to be a Triffid right here. There was a Triffid here. No, oh, is my Triffid dead? Triffid. Oh, there was a Triffid like right here. Wait, unless, let me just, let's see. Nope, the Triffid is indeed dead. Okay, but there's another one right here, so we're all good. So, very easy farm. Fuck off, you wither. Fake wither. Very easy design. Uh, well, very cool design next to the Um, and we got this essence in here. I filled this up with a fuck ton of essence uh, because I've been saving up all of those uh, level things. I also got Dakota to contribute some levels to it. Why do I have a chicken arm? I don't know. But uh, yeah, we got this going. I can summon a bunch more. I might summon a bunch of more minions. But if we come down here, this is where this is the area where we can uh, access the animals and stuff like that. There's a lot of blood in here too. And uh, down there we got a magmatic dynamo, and then we got the other magma thing. What the fuck? Is other magmatic. I heard a weird noise. We got the other magma machine. There it is. The lava fabricator, which sucks in all the lava. Sort of like the Aqu aqueous autonomator, whatever the fuck it's called. And pretty much we have an infinite energy source down there. Very cool. So if I ever want to, oh, I broke every solid air block. Well, you know. Don't worry about that for now because it's fairly easy to get. No problem. So moving on, we got some more details here. We got some bamboo hidden glow globes. A good bit of them are hidden, but if you just fly around, you'll see a good bunch of them. Uh, we go over here. We sort of got. I don't know what this was, but you know, we'll ignore that from that. And then I got Dakota. He's working on his little hobbit hole thing here, which I told him to work on this, and he said, "No, I'm gonna get a start on this other mod." He's Dakota. And, uh, he should finish that soon. I told him to get working on it, and he's like, I will get working on it. And then he never got working on it. Yeah, I told him. So we have this Velociraptor mean here. Dakota uh, is found an interest in those, uh, the mod, the fossil archaeology mod. And his Velociraptor died because it attacked him. So, hey, taking that meat. And we got this little sort of swampish hut out here. And, uh, inside it is a, a villager from the witchery mod just because he looks like he'd be out here and then an imbuing station which is something we messed with last season so now it's time to add in our own additions here uh i want to get more so let's, 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 i want to get more but where should we add these guys for now we don't exactly have an area right now so how about let's go with this for now I don't want to put them in there yet. I want an area where I can put these guys. Uh, let. Hmm. 
Let's put them in that house. So let's move all the villages from inside here to the other houses. Just because I want them to have their own house right now. And, uh, we'll set up some uh, some diversity later. For now, these guys gotta be in their own house. Uh, we'll, we'll slowly uh, settle them in. You know, with the other villages. Because these guys don't get along too long too much. That's why the mushrooms are really hard to find. And the, the mushroom bombs. It's because uh, the villagers were extremely racist to them back in the uh, the Minecraft incident of 2000. And uh, so they want to be in their own room. And I will respect that. You are not exactly standing on the floor. But hey, I'm okay with that. But uh, yeah, these guys, they'll, they'll fit in eventually. But for now, we're going to try and get some more here. Where are these fuckers? I'm going to take all this stuff. They're dropping some stuff. Now... Rotten flesh is something you don't don't look over rotten flesh, man. Rotten flesh is useful. Check this out, check this out. You can use it for smelting? What? Yeah, you can use it for smelting. Which makes it like ten times more useful. So if you think about it, if you can set up a farm with a magnetic dynamo, and uh, you need to power other things, boom bada bing, right there, man. You got yourself some fucking rotten flesh. That shit will power for days, even though you can just make it. But if you have troubles making that, then boom, just make yourself a uh, little thing. Rotten flesh farm, I guess. And you're kind of set to go. I'm just gonna put some of the logo here. Nope. Okay, good. Jesus. Dude. You know what? I'm gonna flip Pendo his ass. Hold on. Flip Pendo! I didn't even really go that far, did he? Alright. Um, you and the guy. Should I use this axe? So we can probably, I can probably make a fucking zombie farm pretty easily just using the uh, villages and stuff like that. Get my donuts. Get my donuts. <laughs> no, not donuts. Uh, oh yeah, the donut shop. That's been going good. Dakota's been making a good amount of purchases. I gotta refill on donuts before he uh, comes back again. Wanted uh, some more. <laughs> so let's throw in this guy here. This to work is that copy probably want that to be yes now the real question is does this work say yes say yes it works I don't know it hasn't spawned anything yet it's, it says work oh oh yes oh yes indeed yes I don't want to fall in. Don't fall in. Nah, no, come on. Come on, man. Oh, yeah. I got to shoot you guys. I forgot. Okay, let's... I'll stop this. Yeah, I forgot. I got to shoot you guys. Oh, shit. You're taking damage. You're taking damage. Don't worry. Don't worry, homie. I got you. I got you. You're safe in the Pokeball. I can heal them easily. Still like a health potion or hit them with a health syringe. And, uh, yeah, they're good. They're good to go. Don't worry. There's, there's no harming. In the making of these uh, mushroom villages. But there's another one in here. He's hidden. Look at him. Look at him hiding. Uh, let's just... Fuck. Uh, seriously, I can't touch him? Come on. Oh, shit. Shit. There's a Pokeball. No, he's in. He's in. Hit him with it. Hit him with it. Oh, thank God. He's safe now. He's safe. Okay. Just throw him in here. Don't worry, man. You're safe now. Oh, shit. I gotta make him... Sit still, I forgot. Okay, um, and then uh, where's the last one? Where's the other one? Go! I saw another one! Oh, he's got yeah, the teleport. Duh. Alright, man. Just come on. Stand still! Stand! The fuck? Oh my god, it fell on the cactus, didn't it? It did. Well, that's not lucky. Okay. And another one here. Are you guys standing still? No, we are good. Alright, so, 
the only other bad thing with these guys is that they will teleport randomly sometimes. Uh, like dogs in Minecraft and cats in Minecraft, they sometimes teleport randomly. At least that happens to me a couple times. I don't think it happens anymore. But I remember playing the console version and it happened to me. Uh, can I put Pendo you? Lependo! Oh, I deflected your arrow, motherfucker. I'm gonna get your ass. Lependo! Capture you or Kendo you across the fucking map. Yeah, we're, we're gonna Spartan kick this guy right off of you. Or Flipendo kick him. Stop, stop, stop. You don't. Stop. Go! It's not working. I'm, come back here. I'm about to impedimenta. Oh, you said you're on fire? He's not on fire. He's not on fire. Okay, here we are at the donut shop here. We're gonna do some donut making. Uh, even though we got, yeah, we got some food on us, but I guess we're really stocked up on donuts anyways. So we gotta be in the human mode for this. To uh, open up this chest here. With the R key. Boop. As you see here, we got a fairly good amount of donuts. Let me take some of these uh, raw donuts, though. Just take a couple. So, we don't have that many. Strawberry donuts, something uh, probably the best. We have a good amount of some of them. We all have cum donuts, shit donuts. I believe I have a bunch of them, and I sold some to Dakota. But as you see, sales are going good. Uh, and I got this little thing here when it comes to delivering the donuts. So after I buy them, I will set them out on that and I'll deliver them to the person. But quickly, I need some another donuts here. Bam! Fuck done now. And I'll put a good amount of these in here. Uh, at least for 20 for me. I'll be eating cook dino for now. Uh, okay. I'll put another rack in there for now. What happens if I maybe the dumbest shit? <laughs> it's something I feel like I do eventually on accident. But so here it is, so if say someone say Dakota is buying donuts. He takes the diamonds, and uh, let's, let's just simulate it here. We'll simulate it. What a, okay, a pig. At least a pig can fit through here. Am I right? Yes. So, buy him, I'm like, hey, you go pay 20 diamonds or whatever, because diamonds are fairly easy to get. But throw diamonds in there. Uh, diamonds will go through the hoppers, lead to this chest, and I will be all right. Your donuts are on the way. Send them away here. They get launched, and if they stand right here, they should receive the donuts. Because I believe the donuts are inside this block right here. I oh, know, I'd have to see the whole entire thing happening at once. Unless they got stuck. I have a feeling that got stuck somewhere. I hope, no, it actually went there. Let's try this Oh, fuck. Those went at like fucking su supersonic speed. Do it slowly. I'll hit the slime jump pad. Go through this ghost block, and uh, very cool things will happen after that. And uh, boom, bada bing, you got your donuts. And for this thing right here, this giant fucking donut. Don't. That was not fun, baby. It doesn't look the greatest because there's not like a solid colored block for every single sprinkle on the chocolate donut. I try to make it look like the chocolate donut. Just get a comparison. But somewhat. Close, somewhat. Uh, I like it. This is, very, this is a very cool thing to make. Plus, I get diamonds from it, and uh, I use a lot of diamonds. Okay, I don't know if I use a lot. Of I use a good amount of diamonds, and I might just take these ones home. I'm gonna find, I'm gonna find a use of diamonds right now, and I'm gonna use a fuck ton of them. Hey, actually, no, we'll save that for some other. Focus heal crystal. What else is there? Make that just, uh, just before we end off this episode. Let's, let us make this device here. And I made all the uh, fos not fos necromancy parts off camera due to the fact that I don't know the recipes by heart. And I had to have a wiki page up. So not the hammer. Smash blocks into parts. Lost chance 20%. When all you got, all you got is an hammer. It's from artifice or artifice. This is interesting. Is 
what? Diamond Slice. Smash blocks into parts. I don't understand. Okay, do I need to be him? I want to be him. I want to understand this. That look like regular fucking speed. Fucking break. Break. Is there like controls for it? There's artifice, artifice, artifice. There is no artifice. Oh! I don't understand. I really want to figure this out now. Right here. Smash block into parts. Smash block into parts. Smash it. Smash it! Okay, hold up. See, so yeah, actually, this is really cool, the diamond sledge. Now, I don't think you use it like this. Uh, I believe you use it like this in a workbench. So, is it like that? No. But what it does is it smashes down, like, crafting tables, uh, chests, furnaces. Smashes them down into the component parts. You saw there, they turn the chest into, uh, eight blocks. And that's a new chest, so the eight wooden blocks. And it smashes them into that. So if you're in a really bad survival situation, well hey, right there, Artifice has got your back. It will not break the crafting table for some reason. I think it's because it's a modded crafting table. Uh, yeah, I'm guessing that's the only reason why. But that is pretty fucking cool. Uh, let's see if we can just make a regular crafting table and see if we'll break that down. Aha, it does. But it ha does have a chance to lose parts. Not as bad, though, if you got a, uh, diamond sledge. <laughs> so, uh, can we... No, we can't break that. Uh, it's things like beacons and furnaces. Can we make a furnace? Let's try it. Oh, do a dispenser. Why do I even have a dispenser? I don't know, but let's break it down. Hey, we got a bow back. That's not bad. So if you find a bunch of useless shit, and you have artifice in your mod pack or something like that, because I know there's a lot of mods here say like fucking it's really good for uh quartz blocks let's actually head to the house right now i do think i actually have some quartz blocks that i can break down and maybe use the quartz itself quartz, quartz itself for something but they're very cool for a mod like orspawn because i know orspawn mobs drop a lot of shit uh this right here we can maybe break the block place i actually don't want to break the quartz here we go we got some quartz let's boop, boop, boop. Okay, here we go yeah, that gives us some quartz back, but obviously the chance to lose stuff is fairly high. Not really, 20% is not bad. Depending on the material you use, uh, decrease, decreases a chance if it's a better material. So diamond is the best chance we can have with 20%. I think wood has like an 80% chance, which is fucking terrible. Don't don't make a wood one. But, uh, 50%. Well, it's not terrible. Um, my name is Gamers11. Hope you guys enjoy this in the next episode. I mean Dakota should be doing something. If not, it'll be me and Ryan doing something in witch witchery. But uh, if I get bored and Ryan and we're we're not ready to record a session yet, I'll do like a another episode like this where I fucking run more random shit in the mod pack. I will see you guys next time.